Yeah. All right, how did you come up with this concept of the of the pod? Well, I mean, I think it's one thing that everyone talks about. Like, for example, yeah. your coordinating producer. Mm-hmm. Mike Hoskins? Yes. Diehard Bills fan? Uh, my heart bleeds, okay? <laughs> being a Buffalo Bills fan is nothing but pain and misery and agony. Of course. Um, you know, what Buffalo Bills fan doesn't say, what if Norwood made the kick? Mm-hmm. What if it isn't wide right? Yeah. How much different do we think about the Bills as a franchise? They might have won all four of those Super Bowls. Right. You know? That one missed kick, because they, they probably should have won two of those four. You know, the Cowboys won when they were up 13 to 6 in Super Bowl 28 mm-hmm. at halftime, and they were shut out in the second half. They lose 30 to 13. Right. And then that one, if, you know, if they win that first one, maybe they win all four in a row. And we're talking about the greatest run in the history of, of the Super Bowl and how we look at that franchise. What does that do to Jimmy Johnson and the Dallas Cowboys and Troy Aikman and their legacy? Everything goes a different way. Or parcels, obviously. Exactly. Everything. No. Everything. And so it's all about looking and finding those alternate routes. Routes. That, routes. The alternate routes. routes. See? We routes. even have to do it to ourselves. The alternate uh, routes yeah. wherever you go. What if yeah. what if David Stern doesn't veto the Chris Paul trade? Boom. And Chris Paul ends up in LA. What if playing with Kobe for the Lakers? Yeah. yeah. And what does that do to the league? Like remember, Chris Paul because of that became adamant about player rights and, and player representation and player power. And the NBA Players Association became the strongest union in yeah. the league basically because of that. Mm. Does any of that happen if if he comes here and plays with Kobe? And by the way, we now know that Andrew Bynum was going bone on bone with those knees. And so yeah. if they kept him as their center, that was a losing proposition. So maybe they don't win. I yeah. can't imagine another situation like that happening right now, right? Where there's a trade. Yeah. Well, I guess it inv- also involved a franchise that was... Taken over by the league. Taken over yeah. by the league. Well, yeah. I mean, like, you know, well, and remember, so. Bud Seeley, when he was the uh, <laughs> temporary, or, or yeah. was it temporary commissioner? What was his? The acting, acting commissioner. Acting, whatever it was. Yeah. He was still the, the owner of the Brewers for like 10 yeah. years before he actually took the actual job yeah. of, of being the commissioner of baseball. Huh. Yeah. Okay, so you just sit around and um, and ideate which one would be a, make for a good pod. And, there are and, a million of them, Rich, though. Right. right now, you can run off and rattle off. And, and a thousand, and, and we try and get as crazy as possible, but <laughs> real. Like, right. like for right. example, there's a one where we're doing. What if because uh, the Lakers and Bulls yes. had a coin flip to find out who would get Magic Johnson number one overall in the 1979 draft? Well, what if the Bulls won that coin flip? There's a scenario there where somehow we have Charles Barkley as the first African American president of the United States. <laughs> So, no, I, and hold on, and why, you play it out, it actually makes sense. It you know is not, I'm not going to tell you on the show. Right. Right. We're going to have to listen to that episode. Wow. Um, you know, I, I I mean, that's one would say that's a leap. Yeah. Um, but you, yeah. you you do connect dots all but, the way through. Does, butterfly it, effect. Is Kevin Bacon involved think. in any way, shape, Six or form? Degree. Well, in almost every episode, Tom Brady is. Tom Brady is in there <laughs> almost affects Tom every Brady. episode. Yeah. Every episode. Even the Chris Paul trade? Uh, Barry, the Barry, what if Barry, Barry Bonds, Bonds. Uh, didn't go to the Giants, somehow changes Tom Brady's career forever? Yeah. What if he goes to the Yankees? What if Barry ends up in the Yankees or someplace else? Yeah. Playing with another guy. Yeah. You do realize this is nightmare fuel for the fans who did have this stuff go their way. Well, actually, you know what we, I mean? we conclude every episode by saying, okay, whatever fans, it was just this. We're all good now. It did happen the way you wanted it to happen. <laughs> so catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free.